Hi, this is Father Erasmus here at a beautiful church. And in my opinion, one of the most beautiful time of the day when the sun filters beautif beautifully um, on our icons, as you can see. And we can see the cross, the icon of the cross, and the angels venerating the icon and the, the cross that was there for veneration. On Sunday, the leftover flowers and um, this is what we celebrate this week. So Father Erasmus is in an empty church, and I miss all of you. I want to let you know that. And it's not the same. Yes, I'm doing the services, but without you being here, it is incomplete. So hopefully this will pass soon, and we'll see the church full again with our beautiful children and adults and families and all the good things that happen here. Um, the parish council and I, and of course the church staff is trying to keep the church open as much as possible to address your needs, to be with you, and to make things function. So please keep uh, your church in your prayers too, uh, the church staff, and also we have to make sure that we also take care of the church financially um, because uh, we need your help, and this is our home. So. Um, as I'm closing, I was thinking, or not thinking, as I know, some people might be scared at this time. That's a reality. You know, God gives us all our emotions, and our emotions are a good thing. However, uh, even though God gives our emotions, the evil one takes advantage of them sometimes, and a, a, a fear that might protect us might also lead us to despair. That's from the evil one. And therefore, we cannot despair. God is still in control. And I am thinking in particular of a psalm that is very popular. And the psalm is uh, Psalm 22 or 23, according to which tradition, that says, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. And um, I've been reading this psalm from pretty much when I was a young child, and because I have a good mom who taught me these beautiful things. But I think the passage there that says later on that even I walk, even though I walk through the valley and shadow of death, I will fear no evil. And because you are with me. And that is my reminder to you that um, we might be passing through a valley of shadow and death because of the darkness of the coronavirus. But as the Psalm tells us, just like a shepherd takes care of a sheep, he will take care of us also. So do not despair, do not lose hope. Every storm passes, and this too will pass. Um, I'm here for you, but more importantly, God is here for you. And I, uh, he loves you, and may you stay safe, and know that your family here at Holy Cross is praying for you, uh, both um, during my private prayers, but also uh, in the church services. Have a blessed day and a blessed week.